amidst economic hardship and inflation in the country. The federal government has suspended duties, tariffs, and taxes on essential food items imported through land and sea, aiming to reduce food prices across Nigeria. However, stakeholders in the Nigerian agricultural sector strongly oppose this decision, arguing it will further impoverish Nigerian farmers and ultimately destroy the nation's agricultural landscape. They contain that the sector, already struggling with various challenges, will face even greater difficulty, competing with cheaper imported produce, which can lead to the dumping of substandard or unsafe food products into the market. Agricultural experts highlight that the suspension of these import duties undermines local farmers, exacerbate existing issues like inadequate infrastructure and limited access to finance and fail to address the root cause of food insecurity. They urge the government to invest in local agriculture by providing subsidies, modern farming equipment, and improved infrastructure to ensure food security and support sustainable growth in the agricultural sector. As Voice of the People TV, we are on the streets to gather the people's opinion regarding the situation. Government lifting um, taxes uh or wave taxes on uh, importation of agricultural products uh, is, is a plus. It is an enabling environment for the to subsidize the cost of living because the cost of living presently is high and is coming from the fact that we have less of agricultural produce, that the local production is not sufficient enough for the citizen to be able to sustain themselves. And so the cost of product, all the agricultural products, the prices has gone up. And because we did not produce enough to sustain uh, the population of the country. And that is why the government is trying to help the economy. Those who are saying that uh, it's a problem to the country, they are actually looking at it. They want to monopolize the economy. They want to be the only one that are producing. And so they are enjoying the high price that is killing the citizens. And that is why they are now looking at it from the fact that uh, it's, a, it's a problem to them. How does it disturb the amount of or the acres of land that they are uh, farming? How does it affect the grain of maize that they want to farm? It does not affect it in any way. You produce your own. And there is, the, 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 we have a large market in Nigeria. So you produce your own, target the market you want to sell, and see whether you will not sell. Is there any of them that come out to say that ah, they are having problems selling their own farm produce? No. So it is never a problem. It is, it is an advantage. It is a way of helping the citizens. What they are saying about sustainable agriculture is foreseeable in the offices where they are. I have a farm in your state where I bought almost about 20 acres. Do you know that since I bought that about four years ago, I've not been, we have not been able to do anything, even with some of my friends that came all the way from Lagos to the place. Fulanis are there, the bandits are there. You understand, they are there. Once you go to anywhere, you start seeing two, one or two of them, you know that they are around. You understand? So if you said maybe sustainable, we will go to the farm now. How many people are in the farm? They have been driven away by these people. So the government had to look at that one first, the first aspect of that. Look at most of the states in the north, the Benue state and others. Nobody, all of them, they are going, going, they go to the farm and they are being captured by them. So they, they, they kidnap them, they capture them, kill them, rape, their, rape the women and so on. Who will go to the farm? So government has to focus more on the military, military solution, intervention to all those places before you talk of sustainable agriculture. I believe due to what government is practicing right now from East states, we will later enjoy the food stuff, to come to come down at the same time things will be all right even some of even my wife told me yesterday that tomato all this pepper is coming down a little bit gradually everything will be all right let's give this government a space for voice of the people tv